Hello! Welcome back to my channel, it's Megara. Hi, if you're new, and we're all zoomed in because I'm doing an eye look. I'm going to be trying out the Jane Styles palette. And I would show you properly, but it's bigger than my head. Because I bought the full size one and... Well, I'm getting into it. It's kind of beautiful. Now, if you don't know, don't know who James Charles is, he's a YouTuber from America who just turned 21. Bit controversial, but I really like the colours of the palette. I'm a colourful person, despite the fact I'm paler than Casper, so I thought I'd create a bit of a bright and colourful look using this half of the palette, mainly. A few things from this side, but mostly this. I'm going to attempt a bit of a rainbow. The main thing is attempt. So I've got my little mirror on my KVD palette and I'm going to go from there to, uh, don't have anywhere to put anything, I need to move my brushes and let's get started. Before I forget, can you like, subscribe? So first of all, I'm going to go in with this colour right here. I do have the names, but I can't be bothered to work out which is which. So I'm just going to go in along my outer corner and lash line and put in that purple, which I think is called... Love that. I'm going to see if I can get it. Nope, it does not want to... There we go. Got the little sheet and it's called Love That, but I know that a lot of people thought we've lost the sheet because I've barely used this palette, which is the only reason I haven't. Now I'm going to keep building on this colour because it's fairly pink at the moment. I'll wing it out until I add. Wing it out a bit. Pack it on. Now my base is set just because that is the way I like to do my eyeshadow. I do that every day kind of thing. Now I'm going to go in with the pink which is called Skip. This colour down in the corner. Pack it on next. So I'm going to do, I'm going to try and do rainbow over two eyes. And this is on Try. So I'm keep building with that pink just to kind of I have got a bit of a plan, don't worry. I'm going to blend that further into the brow bone and stuff a bit into much of all the other colours that are going to be in here in a minute. Now I'm going to go in with the orangey colour here, all rusted. The one on the top line. So where are we at? Got the orange, so now I'm going to go in with the colour next to it, which is called 518. It is this yellowy orangey colour here and I'm going to get, use the same ish brush I do clean it off after each colour just then even though there's going to be kind of cross contamination anyway it means there's going to be less I'll get that on my brush and just I'm going to get a bit of the yellow which is called B the yellow next to the greens because it's the only yellow Properly yellow in here. Get a bit of that and I'm just going to put that on the inner corner. And I'm going to use the other end of this brush, which is more of a fluffy brush, blending brush. I'm going to blend all these colours to kind of refine the edges. Get a clean brush. I use this one, it's by um, Real Techniques. It's called the Smudge Brush. I'm going to use the same colours as I did on the top line along my lower lash line. Then I'm going to use a clean blending brush just to just diffuse the edges. Now I'm going to go with, back in with that yellow shade I used before. Use it on my other inner corner. Clean it off and I'm going to go in with the dark green here which is called Daddy. Weird. That is weird. What would you call the colour Daddy? And I'm going to use a bit of Social Blade which is this green just here. So I'm going to go with Social Blade first. Is a lighter of the two. I'm gonna pack that on my lid and blend it up through the crease. And then I'm gonna use a bit of Daddy. It's so weird saying that. I'm gonna pack that onto my lid. Same as before. Next I'm gonna use a bright blue which is called Playground. This one just here, this would be so much easier if they just printed the names onto the um, palette. 
Then I'm gonna use this darker blue here called Cola. And I'm gonna the same as the last time and just run those colours along my lower lash line again. I'm actually really digging this, having two different eye looks which are completely opposite but also merging together. I'm gonna use a bit of pinkity drinkity, this pink here, just to just to diffuse the edges on my more pinky toned eye. And I'm gonna go stick some eyeliner and that kind of thing on, I'll be right back with you. So I've added lashes, liner, lipstick, highlighter, all of that jazz, and this is the finished look. I am kind of digging it. It's completely fitting for Pride Month, and I love it. I would do this kind of thing for work, but effort, time, I just love sleep too much. So if you haven't done so yet, give that thumbs up, subscribe, because I'm still working my way towards 30 subs, I think, at the moment. So thank you for watching, and I'll see you again next week for another lovely video. Bye!